Sean C. Phillips here with Dweebo, Gina, and Herb. Hey. And we just got back from seeing, I know we may get some weird faces, and <laughs> I know half of the audience we saw this with got up and left. <laughs> yeah, they were dropping like flies. Yeah, they were they leaving. Did. A little bit like Lame Riz. But we saw <laughs> yeah. Parental Guidance, the, you know, Billy Crystal comeback film, like his first... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's his first movie. He's not like, coming back. No, <laughs> not mean, quite. <laughs> it's kind of in the category of the best worst movie. Wouldn't yeah. you say it was? Yeah, kind of like it was that's so bad, bad. It's good, you know. It was good. Yeah, there was a. I couldn't look we away. Went, we went for shits and giggles. <laughs> and yeah. the best the part. Jokes, let's you know. not forget the best part. Dong. Yeah. Dong. Dong. Yeah. Where is he my auto mobile? Candles, you know. Yeah, long uh, dong from sixteen. Oh, sexy candles. girlfriend. It wasn't long dong. No, Dong. Dong. I it was Long Dong. No. Long, long, long Dong Dong was his long name, dog. I believe. And, oh, no. And he was like, hey, what's happening, hot stuff? Right. <laughs> well, he but he didn't say any of that in there, but, you know. Yeah, well, this is his first movie in a while. I wrecked your automobile. <laughs> yes, but basically, yeah. though, yeah, I'm sort of like the, the guy in the back. And another really crazy appearance was... <laughs> Where um, are you? You're in the you back. You know. Tony, Tony Hawk shows up. But let's and, talk about yeah. what it's about, though. Okay. Let's not talk about the, all the appearances. The basic premise, you but know. But basically, though, it was, you know, Billy Crystal and Bette Midler. Were the grandparents. Were the grandparents. And that weren't really involved with their grandchildren. They never really saw the children, yeah. And the family, you know, uh, Marissa Tomei and her husband, they had to go to some kind of a work-related thing, so they didn't know who to leave the kids with. And the, his parents yeah, were busy. Uh, they were on a cruise, the main parents the favorite them grandparents mm -hmm. so then they they have to end up coming so it's one of those kind of things with all the problems happening and Marissa Tomei is too afraid to leave them you know actually leave so yeah. the husband's gone Doesn't and really she's trust all them. kind of staying around going oh, I'll leave tomorrow I'll leave the next day and that kind of a thing she's sort of extending as long as she can without the husband getting too mad about you know the fact that she he's there on a trip alone. Yeah, and, and, the, and the house they lived in was sort of the great big beautiful tomorrow house. It was kind of like that smart house, like Disney yeah, movie or end, something. Remember, it was like weird. The, the last tomorrow house with all the futuristic things. Mm -hmm. like, had all these sort know, of built-in computers Joe was that in the would... house, and there was like that cheap yeah. joke too with calling well, Billy Crystal. Like, what were they calling him? Like, oh, Farty. his name Farty. was Artie. They, they kept calling him Farty. Yeah. Farty. And there was also a side. There was also another plot with Billy Crystal was recently fired. You know, he was a sports announcer for a baseball team, and mm -hmm. he was recently fired, so he was kind of depressed about that. It was that. supposed to be a feel-good movie. No, yeah. It, did. I, you know, it was okay. I mean, you know. Kind you of know. in a Jack and Jill sort of way, but, you know. Yeah, I mean, I, I thought it was all right. It was like not nothing. We did see Lady Lady Miz, you know. I didn't, we didn't want to do a whole review on that. Yeah. But it was, I mean, we don't know a whole lot about that. It was it That's was not true. I know I'm, all about oh, it. I'm more it's a, a stage show. No, I know. Go to the stage show. Yeah. I mean, I'm more a little shop of horrors type what about person though, if I'm going to watch well, some know, the musicals. The best singer, but, you know, know. Russell Crowe. There is something for the answers. I am coming for you now. Yeah, and then there's the one right? the, yeah. the one dude in that, he was like, oh, yeah. Oh. And then he was very and high voice. I kept yeah. on thinking, it's getting kind of hard to believe <laughs> yeah, the things we have said. It was painful. It was. Yeah. No, it was, there was a little bit. Oh, bad. there's going to be a lot of people that really no, like it. No, there's no talking. There's all singing. Yeah. Yeah. Hardly any dialogue. Is, it wasn't a poor movie or anything. It was just no. like I think the singing every single line of that one was Too a little weird. But let's talk more. about I like the Anne Hathaway so. singing. I don't like know this when you're talking. You know. I have Lulu hair up my nose. We're talking about Chrono Guidance, though. Oh, you know, well, I'm, I'm actually, if you're speaking of other things, I was sort of looking forward to that sort of Jack and the Beanstalk type thing with that Nicholas oh, Holt guy, you know, know from that. Skins That's and stuff. That's got Alice Virgin in it. The guy That's like got all these people in it. I think yeah, I'm I blocking you, Sean. No, it's I like know. weird. I don't know. I don't know about that one. But, you know, for this, do you think people should see this? Do you think it's like a worthwhile seeing in theater? No. Seeing Billy uh, Crystal get hit in the balls? No. Uh, ball joke. Get Watch Benny Hill. And, no, uh, but if you want to see a Billy Crystal You know what movie, this movie was? This was for the airplane. Yeah, like yeah, yeah one of those ones like you'd have like your yeah, headphones out, not even hearing any of the dialogue, and just sort of watch along. And uh, he got kicked they in the nuts. They both have such facelifts; it was mm. a little. Tough. No, I know. If I, you want to see it, see it for Dong. Yeah, Dong. yeah. he was the best thing Dong. in the whole movie. Yeah, yeah he, he was. I was glad that he sort of came back throughout. I mean, you know, he was no, there I mean, a little he bit. He was the best. Thing yeah, I think he was However, like, oh, I better be in it more. No, I, I might have shed end. a tear at the yeah. end. Oh, I did. What happens, it was a little yeah. emotional. Yeah, yeah. And there was a part. Yeah. Yeah, especially someone you know who dealt with something with speech, and I had you know speech problems. Yeah, that's still that's too exactly what I was right. remembering. Yeah. So it was kind of like you know getting to me some of the stuff. All those. Speech. But we don't want to ruin everything. But we're not yeah. really ruin anything. How could you ruin it? No, no most people aren't going to do it. Anyway. <laughs> what are you going to spoil? And most people got up and left. So <laughs> yeah, yeah. People but, actually left. Now, out of the star ratings, what would you give it? 
Oh, it would have oh. to be a out of five. Out of people like oh, five. it would be a stinker. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, that it's might be half a star. Maybe, maybe one and a half stars. Yeah, well, well, the benefit the of the is doubt for like a fun Absolutely. shits and giggles movie. Yeah. And for that, it's a five for a shits and giggles fun movie. Well, then but you would take not. Nah, it's no. It's no Bucky Larson if you're no, looking for that kind of. thing. No, but no. I mean, it's. it's I like. Hilarious. I like the other one better than we saw. This is forty. This is yeah. forty. Yeah, yes. this is forty is much. Better. Even though people didn't like it, but a lot I of people it. won't get it unless they're forty. No, you know, that's true. a lot of a lot of people that are younger are not going to relate. But it, it that was true, worthwhile yeah. seeing. I but was, I think that's probably all we got to say on this. There's not much to go on, really. I mean, no. it's sort of getting hit with. It was a bit of a Christmas and, uh, turd. I'm afraid, <laughs> yeah, I think it was. To be honest, yeah, with it yes. wasn't. There was no Christmassy stuff in it either. It was sort of like marketed like something to see on Christmas. Just end it just for fun with "I Dreamed a Dream." So let's all see if we can sing. You know, end this okay. video. I couldn't. Dream. What have I done? Yeah. No, no, oh. no. That's not, not that. That's a little bit. You know, I dreamed a dream that we were. Just sort of make it up as you go. I dreamed. I dreamed a dream that I went to a good movie, and instead I saw. Movie. I uh, saw Billy Crystal's <laughs> face. It looked like this. Yeah. It was. Yeah. It was. What first. was Tony Hawk thinking? Yeah. yeah. What have I done? <laughs> oh, what has he done? What have I done? Yeah, I know. Uh, jokes about the nine hundred. I don't know. I, I even the thing with Billy Crystal. I even like my giant. No one like that. Yeah. yeah, but let's just end this with that. So we'll see you later. Yeah, see you later. And we'll see, see we'll be seeing Django Unchained. It's just very long, but we'll be seeing it. Yeah, I want to see that. I'm looking forward we'll to that. Seeing it. I'll, right, be, I'll be seeing it like this. Yeah, right. yeah so we'll see you later. <laughs> All right, then. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.